What's up everyone? Welcome to our channel. In this video, we will guide you through a step-by-step -step process on how to use HubSpot CRM. Be sure to watch the entire video to gain a comprehensive understanding. Without further delay, let's get started. First of all, open the web browser. Here search HubSpot. Click the first link to open the site. Once the site is open, you can see they are offering a free start. Click on Get Started Free button. It leads you to the form of Create Your Free Account. From here, you can sign up with Google, Apple, Microsoft. It's 100% free and no credit card needed. Click on the Continue as for Google button. Now your account is open with Google. From the menu bar, you can see the provided features. Click to open every feature, then see their sub-features, what they work or how. In contact, you can contact companies, calls, etc. Then in conversation, you can talk in inbox, chat flows, templates, etc. When you click on marketing, you can see ads, email, landing pages. Website, social, the feature is included in Marketing Hub Professional. From sales, you can see deals, forecasts, tasks, etc. In services, you can get tickets, feedback, etc. Then, go through automation, report as well. You can also discover what your tools can do. Also, you can add contacts, invite contacts. Or you can create contact by clicking its button from the left corner. Now you can see we have three options. All contacts, my contacts, unassigned contacts. We have the details of contacts. Like contact owner, create date, lead status, advanced filters. Now from data quality, choose the action you want to perform. Like edit properties, manage duplicate, fix formatting issues, restore records. You can also import the contact here. Then click on Create Contact button from here. Fill up the form it shows you. Enter your email, name, job title, phone number. In the phone number, add your country code, then number. If it shows any error here, Open the new tab, search Fake Number Generator. Open its site. Now select any country from here. Click on Generate Phone Number. It shows you some active numbers in the United States. Choose any number and copy that number. Paste that number back into Create Contact. Then click on Done. Select your life cycle stage. Then Lead Status. After filling up the form, click on Create. Now you can see the contact is created successfully. You can now send him email, call, task, meeting message on social sites, etc. You can see his communication subscription. Website Activity, Site Visits, Page Viewed. From Overview, Create Date, Lifecycle Stage, Last Activity Date. Then from Marketing, click on Ads. Click on Continue This Network. If it doesn't work, then click on Explore on My Own. From Ads, see which ads are turning visitors into customers. Then click on Create Ad Account. See the options through which you can continue creating accounts. Now click on See a Quick Demo. Then click on I've never run ads before. Click on Start Demo. Then press Next for ads. 
Now it asks you to click on Lead Generation. Then show you the form to fill for the ad you want to run. Click on Next. Add the category, remarking, location, interest, etc. Click on Next. Then click on Publish from the left corner. Now click 1 from the contact number. Here you can see who's interested in your ad. Click on the person's name and see ads activity. Then click on Finish Demo. Now click on Deals from Sales. Here you can see all the details of deals type. Owner details, date, last activity, etc. You can perform different actions, import or create a deal. Click on Create Deal to fill up the form. Give its name, deal stage, enter amount, add the close date of deal. Select Deal Type is Priority, Add Items. Click on the Create button. As you can see, the deal is created. You can see every single detail of it. If you click on Deals from Sale, now you can see your created deal here as well. Click on its preview to see its details. Now click on Task from Sales. Skip the tour. See the details of every function it performs here. Click on the Create Task button. Fill up its form. Give title, type, priority, due date, etc. After filling the form, click on Create. Now you can see the task you created, also its details. Check out Payments from Sales. Automation Sequence Workflow. From Reports, click on Analytics Tools. You can choose Custom Behavior, Traffic Analytics. Now click on Dashboard from Reports. From here, you can have an overview of everything. Email, Marketing, Sales, etc. Create Dashboard, click on Next, give Dashboard name, limit its access. Then click on Create Dashboard. Now, go to your dashboard. Here you can see landing page total views and from submissions. Scroll down the page to see every detail in it. You can create a dashboard, perform actions, share, etc. Click on Manage Dashboard. See the dashboard you created. Click on the home icon, minimize the page. Thanks for watching, I hope it was useful. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe to get notified for new videos.